As you can see the drive itself right here. Check it out, everything looks great. Very heavy. Hey everyone, Digital David here. Today in this video, I'm gonna be checking out the Toshiba X300 performance hard drive. I did purchase this product myself and any opinion expressed in this video is strictly my own. That being said, if you're interested in this product, you wanna find out more about it, the link to it will be in the video description. You can see the retail box and packaging right here. Check it out, everything looks great. So they walk us through some of the quick tech specs. So for this particular drive, we have the 10 terabyte version. They have multiple storage capacities available depending on your needs. It's a 7200 RPM disk drive with a 256 megabyte buffer. Now let's go ahead, let's open it up and look at the contents. Here are all the contents. First up, you can see with a warranty statement followed by our quick start guide in multiple languages with the QR code and their customer service and contact info. Next, you can see the drive itself right here. Check it out, everything looks great. Very heavy, 10 terabyte drive, 7200 RPM. We already talked about those specs. Let's look at it from every side and angle. So you can see it up close, and then here it is from the back side. So everything looks great, just a standard 3.5 inch drive. Now let's go ahead, let's plug it in and try it out. So we got the hard drive plugged into our PC. You can see first up we have our available free space. So you can see 9.09 .09 terabytes out of the 10 terabytes shows up as usable free space within Windows. And then I went ahead, I conducted a quick benchmarking test and you can see our read and write results right here. So basically 250 megabytes a second for our read score and around 240 megabytes a second for our write speeds. While the performance of this drive is nothing to get excited about this day and age, you can get excited about the price per gigabyte or the price per terabyte compared to solid state drives. So if you're okay with the performance decrease and you don't need to have those faster read and write speeds, but you wanna have something that's affordable to store a lot, a lot, a lot of data, then this is gonna be a drive you definitely wanna check out. 